33,294 people were sexually assaulted in 2022. Now, one county in the east is taking action by raising awareness and reminding people of services offered through one county program, our Merritt Morgan. She spoke to the program manager and a woman who is sharing a recent attack against her and hopes it doesn't happen to anyone else. A normal trip to the grocery store. It's a lot of fear. Honestly, it was very unexpected. Turned into a nightmare for Patrice Wallace. It was early in the morning, so I thought I was going. Nobody was going to be there. You know, just very unexpected, a lot of fear, and I think disbelief because of when he did touch me and grab me, it was just kind of like, what just happened? She says it happened at a Greenville Boulevard store last week. I was at Walmart on Wednesday just shopping as usual in the aisle and all of a sudden I looked up and there was a guy like really close to me in my face and he walked by and he grabbed my butt. Wallace is still struggling to feel okay after that experience. He's walking really fast towards me and so then I run. Um, I run and I find two um, employees in the store. Following the frightening encounter, Wallace says a police report with Greenville Police was filed. According to GPD, an investigation into the alleged assault is underway. According to the North Carolina Coalition Against Sexual Assault, one in five women will experience sexual assault in North Carolina. With the month of April being Sexual Assault Awareness and Prevention Month, Carteret County is doing their part to spread the word. We provide victim advocacy for any victims of sexual assault, um, past or present. Uh, we do education <clears throat> and presentations in the community to bring awareness um, about our program and about uh, ways to prevent sexual assault and help support the survivors. Um, we go to the hospital with uh, survivors when needed. We can help them through the court process. Services that Wallace says are vital to recovery. I've actually started myself. Um, I've noticed even with myself, I'm jumpy. Like I kind of don't want to go to the store right now, um, especially not by myself. Trauma, you know, things that happen if we don't deal with them, it only grows and becomes a bigger problem. So I would definitely encourage someone to seek out counseling programs um, just to take care of the issue. I was Merritt Morgan reporting. For more information on the Carteret County Rape Crisis Program, National Sexual Violence Resource Center, and the National Sexual Assault Hotline, you can find a link on our website, WITN.com.